What up, everybody? It's Nemesis here. Today, I'm bringing you guys another Gears of War 3 gameplay, and I will be showing. I will. I will be telling you guys the time I almost pissed my pants. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's kind of kind of scary, man. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, me and my friends. Well, my friends. They were going to Six Flags for my friend Megan's birthday, and they invited me to go. I don't know why they invited me to go because I'm afraid of heights. Yeah, I said it. I'm afraid of heights. But they invited me to go, and I was like, ah, I want to go, but then I don't want to go because I'm going to be bored because I'm not getting on any rides, and I don't want to get on any of those little bitty dumb rides. But then I changed my mind, and I went instead. And Jury, I believe, took my kill there, but I went instead because it was really nice outside that day. And I did not want to stay in looking like a person who has nothing to do with their life. So they picked me up and whatever. And my friend Chris and Megan, they said that this, well, Megan said that her friend Maya was coming. And she, well, they claimed that she was so sexy. <laughs> and I was like, okay. Right, I said okay because, you know, I didn't know what she actually looked like. You know how people say that one person looks really really good but when you see them for yourself you're like eh, no no so they on the rides or whatever when we get six flags they're on the rides or whatever and they're having fun i wasn't on any rides i was just eating blue and red cotton candy i bought like five of them because i love cotton candy and i also had some of these um it's some sticks some like brown stick thingies with some red strawberry filling or sometimes banana filling i don't know the name of it but i was eating those and i was having fun just getting prizes i had the i had the hammer thingy i almost won but i was weak i was weak back then yeah <laughs> but anyways um so after they got off the ride they're like kevin why you didn't get on your rides and i just looked at them like how long have you known me? You know I do not like heights. So, I actually said it. After I thought about it, I was like, you know I don't like heights. And I gave them the look. I gave them the look. And it's like, well, if that if the girl come and she see you not get on any heights, she might not want to talk to you. And I thought about that for like five minutes. And, and she finally showed up. And they introduced me and her. And after they walked off, I was like, are you single? And she was like, yeah. And I was like, oh, shit, I'm in it. I'm in it. <laughs> so then we get to talking and stuff. We get to know one another. And out of the blue, they all come and say, Kevin, if you want to um, get with my friend here, you got to get on some of these rides. And I was looking like, are you serious? You would do that. Are you serious? And she was, yeah, she, they wasn't in line when they said she was sexy. She was fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, I asked them what ride do they want me to get on first, and I did not want to do it. But then again, I did not want to look like a non-live. That didn't make sense. I didn't want to look like a pussy in front of her, so. I get on the ride. And I'm, I'm just looking normal, but deep inside, I was like, I was going through a phase, a tantrum, like, why, 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 why? So then, they strapped the, they strapped the seat belt around me. I was scared. I got so scared. It was so scary. And then we was pulling off, and she winked at me, and I was like, oh my goodness. Suck it up. Suck it up, fool. So I'm sucking it up. And when the ride was over, it wasn't that bad. I forgot which ride was it first. But then it's like, see, Kevin, you don't even look like you was that nervous. And I'm like, mm-hmm, yep. Playing it all tough. So then they made me get on, I believe it was the Batman or the Superman or the American Eagle. I don't know. I haven't been to Six Flags in a while. But after I got off that ride, I was twitching, my legs was twitching, I was shaking, and it was like, are you okay? And I was like, mm-mm, no, 
I'm not okay. I did the I did the freaking challenge you wanted me to do. Now can I talk to her? And even though Megan wanted me to get on some more rides, <laughs> she was mad. But she wasn't too mad. She was like, yeah, sure. So they left us alone. We started talking. I felt better. Kiss me on the cheek. And I was happy the whole day. Yep. I was that happy the whole day. And then that week of school, I just couldn't stop talking about the time I was afraid of heights. That was officially the first time. Wait, let me see. Yep, that was officially the first time I witnessed the height scary thingy, whatever you want to call it. Being afraid of heights. When I was little... I used to think that airplanes was like one of the safest places to travel and like because I never got on an airplane till this day so after uh, after like three or four months after I what what you call it I thought about that I hear on the news some people died on the airplane because it crashed and I was like that's exactly why you will never catch me traveling in an airplane. You can catch me on a bus, in a car, on a bike, on a yeah, on a bike. I I pedal my way to where I'm going. <laughs> on a bike, on a motorcycle, on a scooter, on a skateboard. Yeah, on a boat. I might get seasick. I'm weird. Yeah, I'm weird. I mean, but there's a lot of people who are afraid of heights. I know people that's afraid of swimming. Yeah. People are afraid of swimming. I'm not one of those. I know people that's afraid of um, heights. Um, I don't know. It's a lot of stuff. It's a, I know you a couple of you guys out there are afraid of heights. So don't go out there calling me pussies and nemesis afraid of heights because it's not. Well, because it's. I don't know, man. Ugh. Like. I want to go have fun. One of these days, I'm just going to face my fears and just get on them rides freely without freaking hesitating. Because that's what I do. Yeah. That's what I do. And I don't know if you guys hear it, but if you hear meowing in my background, Jerry, you, you took my kill. You bastard. But if you hear meowing in my background, it's my cat. And she's really irritating. So. Yeah. See you guys next time. Peace.